Creativity, I think, is a calling of humans beyond just existing. If we're giving that capacity, we should really flex those muscles. The art department is all about finding your voice within your medium and what you want to do. The Stern Art Department focuses on foundational studies in drawing and painting and design, and then offers upper level electives in the areas that our faculty are experts in. Ultimately, you could build your own program to any end. If you want to go down to a basic assortment, it's graphic design, interior design, fine art making, sculpture, pre-architecture, and theater design. Fashion design, film and video, art therapy, photography, and even animation in some cases. There's a wide range of ideas and thoughts running within these walls. When the elevator will go up to the eighth floor and I'll be with students who don't know there's an art department, they'll be like, oh, what floor is this? And I'll be like, oh, it's the art department, you should check it out. The studio art department here at Stern is a familial space. It's a very open, friendly vibe. That is so essential to becoming better artists and helping each other. When I've taught in other places, there's a tendency to maybe get a little too competitive. I don't see that here. The ethos of Yeshiva University certainly impacts the art. There is a sense of warmth and community in a lot of the work. When a class of art majors is graduating, I feel like I know each of those students and their work really well. I've seen how they've developed as young artists from coming in and taking those first beginning classes to developing their senior projects. I have a series of pieces in the upcoming senior show. This is one of the pieces. It, it plays with changing the color and changing the typography, changes the meaning, because it's like light pink and cotton candy fonts. It's like lighthearted. You wouldn't really stop and care if you saw the sign. You wouldn't be scared to walk in. It came from a lot of the freelance work I do. My like, clients not really knowing what design is and they don't really understand the design process. So it takes into account how changing the design changes the meaning. My project, Too Muchness, is a mixture of colorful whimsicalities where the person in the project realizes that she can't be boxed into one persona because we are multifaceted people and through life we change. I used to believe that art had to be this technically complicated thing, something that would make people feel uncomfortable. I kept gravitating towards motifs of joy and calm, I realized that my voice within my artwork is to make people feel happy. There are so many people that will see it and I won't know their stories and I won't know their backgrounds, but I know that they will see my piece and take whatever they want to take from it and hopefully feel a moment of resonance and joy. <laughs>